Christopher Hitchens. Let's go to Cambridge, Maryland. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you very much. Mr. Hitchens, I have three direct questions, short questions for you, please. Do you feel that Israel has a right to exist within secure borders? Do you feel that the United States should intervene should Iran and or Russia try to close the Straits of Hormuz? And would you seek relief from a 24-hour shoot-on-site curfew from any quarter uh, in which relief might be found? Thank you. All right, thanks for the call. Very good questions, and, and I think I know what you're trying to pin me down on. Uh, on the first, yes, I do, um, but I think the securely recognized borders should not allow for Israeli colonization or occupation of the territory of its neighbors, which is what it's doing now. The right to exist argument has been, um, has been used now to the point where what it's going to mean is that the Israel you're talking about will include the, uh, the annexed and illegally occupied West Bank. Um, so the right to exist argument is going to rebound on those who use it unclearly and who don't say what they mean by Israel. It's very interesting, the Israeli um, government has never said uh, where it thinks the borders of Israel really ought to be and what it would settle for. I think it would be an immense help if Israel's going to insist on the right to exist, if it tells us where it thinks Israel's boundaries should be. Every other country does do that. 